Chapter 1 The Blueprint To provide you a visual of what we are discussing, this book will reference analogies between your workforce preparation tools and building a house because visuals can sometimes help clarify the process we will be using. So, before we get started, take a minute to think about the home construction process as if you were a builder. As an owner of a construction company, what would happen if you decided to begin construction on a new house without a plan? For starters, you will not know how many materials to purchase. This oversight would lead to either a surplus or a deficit. For example, if you purchased enough supplies for a two-story house when the owner only requested a one-story house, you and your construction company would be left with enough materials for two one-story houses. Since you purchased and paid for the materials for the project, you may want to pass these charges on to the brand new owner of the house for all the materials, even though it was your error. Chances are the new owner would be unwilling to foot the bill for your mismanagement, which may cause you and your construction company to lose money on the project and the new owner to question whether you should build their new home. Two things nobody wants when running a business, let alone a small business. The opposite of this scenario would also put you and your company in a negative light in the eyes of the new homeowner due to your lack of planning and preparation. If you started construction on a new home, you would not only want to know the quantity of the materials required, but also each type and color of each material needed. A couple examples would be if the owner wanted a log cabin, and you and your construction company purchased materials best suited to a home with siding, or if you purchased tan siding when the new homeowner had requested gray. Not properly planning, Mismanagement of building materials and poor execution are all scenarios that would not be conducive to any company retaining credibility or longevity for any length of term of their business. We have a responsibility to ourselves and our family to ensure we lay out a blueprint for our professional career, just as builders should lay out a blueprint for each house they are contracted to construct. In the simplest terms, the blueprint for the house of you is caring enough to prepare for the workforce, regardless of your chosen field of study or expertise. When you care enough to prepare, whether it be in your personal life or your professional career, you are making a conscious effort to control your own destiny to the greatest extent possible. While controlling your own destiny may only seem possible in a fantasy world, Controlling your own destiny in areas where you have control can be a reality. For example, when you woke up today, did you have control over what time your alarm would go off? Did you have control over taking a shower, brushing your teeth, and selecting what outfit you wanted to wear for the day? For most of us, the answer is yes. I had control over those areas today, as I do almost each and every day. The beauty of these examples is that no matter if you live in Beijing, China, or Green Bay, Wisconsin, or whether you speak Chinese or English, almost all of us have elements of our lives that we can control to a great extent. In future chapters, I will mention quite a few areas of your life that are within your control as they relate to you and your professional career, as well as things that are out of your control. I want to convey to you the importance of spending your time and energy on the areas that you can control and not to worry about things that are outside of your control. This will help alleviate the stress that comes with worrying about things such as what others will think and say about you both in front of you and behind your back. I want to be clear on this because there have been times over the course of my professional career where I have wondered what individuals think or what they might say or feel about a professional event, such as an interview. What I have found is whether or not I worry or analyze each situation, the outcome of that particular event will come and go. The next day, the sun will rise and a new day will begin. Time does not worry. Time only advances, and so should you. 
Save yourself a lot of needlessly wasted time, energy, and stress by controlling what you can control and not concerning yourself with what you cannot control. Having a blueprint gives you the laser focus and strength to put your best foot forward, to know what you can do and what might be best suited for someone else, to be prepared when given the opportunity to showcase your talent and skills, and to thrive and exceed all expectations for yourself and your family. We want to be focus builders, builders who plan and exceed expectations, not the hypothetical builder we read about earlier in the chapter. The time has come to advance and get started on our foundation.